Hello friends, it's been a long time no see um, and there's a good reason for that. So why don't we just kick off this video by sitting down and catching up. I have been looking forward to this moment now for what feels like months, but it kind of started all in December. Um, there are many factors that led to our decision, um, most that I will keep private for myself and Steven. However, there were so many things that went into our decision, and some of you also started picking up on Instagram that the house was looking bare. <laughs> Someone was like, where are all of your decorations? And that's because I have slowly been packing up the house, styling the house to sell it, and we're moving. Yes, we are moving to Charlotte, North Carolina. If you have followed for a while, you know that is where it kind of all began. So we are returning back to where Stephen and I met, where we share some of our happiest memories as a couple. But most importantly, the reason behind this move is for my family. As you guys know, my sister and my nieces are there. We are also looking to get my parents permanently there. And that's really the driving force behind all of this. I'm still kind of processing it all because it is moving quicker because God has literally opened every single door for this to take place. We sold the house this past weekend. We got an offer that was better than we could have imagined in every aspect. <laughs> um, and we close on the house in April, so we have to get moving. And it was such a blessing because we already got a house in Charlotte. And when we first moved to New York from North Carolina, we had to carry both houses for several months. And that was a huge stressor and something that I was really thinking about and concerned about. So the house is sold here. Um, and we have our house in Charlotte. What I wanted in this new space was really a blank canvas for us to work in. And we found it out, insert some pictures of our new home here. I wanted light and airy. I think upstate New York lent itself to a more moody space. And I think like the sunshine and the warmth of North Carolina, I wanted something with lots of natural light, which is important when filming. And just like light and airy. And what we found is perfect. And it also has some things that remind me of this house as well. You'll see um, that it has a similar staircase, the way it comes down into the living room. It just, it just felt like us when we found it. So we have our house in Charlotte. We can't move in there until April 18th. So we will have an Airbnb. We're looking at those currently for our first couple weeks in Charlotte settling in, and then we'll have all of our stuff delivered. I have been selling and purging and giving to friends so many different things, but now the real packing has to begin. And for me to have some of that time, I am actually leaving my job after 13 years on March 8th. Like I said, I wasn't filming because there were so many conversations that had to be had and plans that had to be made that I didn't want to share the news or film, and you guys notice differences in the house, until I knew all those conversations had taken place to honor and respect um, everyone involved. But it's a big change for me, but something that I'm also so excited for, and if I'm being honest, probably really need. I think it has been 20 years since I've lived near my parents, and 13 years since I've been near my sister. And I see them a handful of times a year, um, which is really challenging. And I missed my whole niece's childhoods. They're now in college and high school. And I want to be able to spend time with them and hang out with them and really get to know them as like the young adults that they are. And it's just not something I've always had the opportunity to do. As you know, Stephen's family, his parents live up here. His sisters are all spread out. However, when we told them, they were so supportive. In fact, they were more excited about having another place to visit. So we knew that this was the time and the right decision for us as a family. And I can't wait to vlog in a new city and explore it together. Although it'll be, it's not new, but it'll feel so new because it's been so long since we've lived there. 
and for my sister to be involved and for you guys to see that side of my life because it's so important to me. My sister and I literally keep texting each other saying like, I cannot believe it's happening because we've talked and dreamt about this moment. So yeah, we're moving. I am done with work March 8th. Then we will move at the beginning of April. I'm going to vlog the whole thing. We're going to vlog the moving. Tomorrow's video is actually going to be about um, how I styled the house for selling photographs and all those. I'll even share some of the photographs with you and like the thought process around um, the way I styled the house. Our house sold in nine days, uh, which we were thrilled about because I didn't anticipate it moving as quickly as it did. But yeah, life is good and I'm excited for a fresh start and some new adventures. Steven secured a job with a law office there. He's really excited about it. Yeah, as far as my work, I haven't decided what I want to do next in this new chapter. So I'm going to explore a lot of options. In the meantime, you'll probably get a lot of content because we're going to have to decorate an entirely new house. And I could not be happier to share this news and also take you along on the journey and get ready for some content this week as we think about styling the house for selling and then getting into the real packing. But I love you all so much. And yeah, let the new chapter begin. And I'm so glad I'll be able to share it with all of you. So take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind, kindness is free, give it to everyone until next time, which will be tomorrow. Bye-bye, friends.